Hello everyone, welcome to Sherry's Tube. Do it again, do it. Let's do it again. Do it again, do it. Hello everyone, and welcome to Sherry's Tube. And I'm back again this weekend to give you guys a brand new haul. Now, let me just first explain that um, I went shopping a few times throughout the week. So what I did is uh, I bought a few things. I wanted to put them away. So I am. Um, so I went on and did a. I went on and did a video for those things. And so what I'm going to be doing is adding to this video because I don't like stuff sitting out for a long time before I do a haul, you know what I'm saying? So that's why you may see pieces together, but it's for one haul and it is for this week, okay? Because I already caught up with all my other hauls and everything. Now I am on pace, all right? So let me just say thank you to all my new subbies. I really appreciate that. You know, you guys following me and subscribing to me and things like that. Also, thanks to my current um, subbies who's been with me for the longest. Thanks, guys, for watching my videos, leaving comments, and doing the thumbs up. Also, you can follow me on social media, Instagram, Twitter, YouTube, uh, Facebook, and it seems like I always miss one. YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, Google+, all right? All the information is below. You can also thumbs up this video if you like, and you can leave a comment below. All right, so let me just show you guys um, a few things that I bought, and then I want to show you some things that I uh, made, a DIY, okay? And I may show you my table. I don't, know, I don't know if I'm going to show you my table on this video or uh, when I get ready to complete the whole thing, okay? So if I don't do it on this part, then eventually I'll show it before this video is over, okay? So let me go ahead because my daughter only gave me 20 minutes all together, so I got to hurry up. So this is Dollar Tree. I think all of these things are from Dollar Tree, if I'm not mistaken, besides maybe a couple things, maybe one or two things maybe from the 99 cent store, okay? But anyway, from DT, DT, I got, I finally went on and got some of this Fabuloso. I saw it and I was like, um, people keep on talking about this. So maybe if I can get this for my kid's bathroom, it'll smell better. So I went on and got this type right here, which is the um, Passion of Fruits. And I didn't smell it yet, so let me smell it right quick while I'm on video. Real quick, let me see if I can do it real quick. Oh yeah, that smell. Oh yeah. Mm, that smells good, man. Man, it smells too good to be on the floor, huh? That smells really good. Yeah, I like that. So hopefully it works good and hopefully it does the job for the bathroom, my kid's bathroom, because if it does, then I'll get some more. So I got one container of this. This is the biggest one, which is a 22 fluid ounce container or 650 milliliter, okay? So yeah, Fabuloso. And they only had a limited supply of this. So hopefully if I, when I go back to Dollar Tree again this weekend, I'll see um, some more and I'll pick up a few. Okay, then I finally found some of these dishcloths. Two or there are two in here, the Terry dishcloths. I mean, I haven't seen these in DT in a long time. These are the original dishcloths that I usually, you know, use. So I was glad to see this, but they only had this one pack. So again, when I go back to DT, I'm going to see if they have any more so I can get a stock of these. Okay. Because they do work pretty good. Then I got some of this right here. I saw somebody um, haul these, and I could not believe that Dollar Tree had these. So I searched around, went to a bunch of Dollar Trees, and I finally found um, some. They had like three or four there, so I just got two. This is the Clean Fresh Scent. These are fragrance boosters. You know, they sell these in the store, you know, the regular kind for like eight, nine, ten. $11, $12, depending on where you get it from. So when I saw this from DT, I was like, let me get a couple of these. So I left the other two, and I got these two. Okay, and I think you put this in the washing machine when you wash your clothing before you put everything else in, and it is supposed to make your clothing smell pretty good. Let me smell this scent and see what it smells like. Okay, smells pretty good. I like it. This is the Clean Fresh scent. I'm always getting the Clean Fresh scent because I don't like all those different type of fragrance on my clothing and things like that. So yeah, I got that. This is the 15 ounce container or the 425 gram. And I got two of these, okay? So search around because it's better to pay a dollar than 10 or 20 and it has the same chemicals and stuff in it. So just don't, I, I don't use that much of it anyway. 
Okay, and then I think that was it that I got from Dollar Tree on this part of my haul video. Okay, I'm sure I'm, I'm going to go back to DT and get more stuff. Stuff that you haven't seen, because I may not haul anything that you've seen, really. If I do, it'll be just like a couple things, because I'm getting bored watching the same things over again. When I watch other videos, I'm like, I'm getting bored watching the same old stuff over again. So I definitely want to show different stuff in my videos. And I may have a few things that I get every week, but I'm going to try to show different things. Okay, so from Walmart, I did go to Walmart and I did pick up some more of these um, gems because I'm doing a lot of DIY projects in my apartment and, you know, I like to replace stuff. Not replace, but I like to change stuff around. I don't really put all this stuff out at the same time, but I like to change your stuff depending on the season or the mood that I am in. So I got these color gems to make something with. So, let's see what else I got. I think, guys, you know what? I think that's all. Oh, yeah, I got another one of these sick daisies from the 99 cent store. I love these things. I put one on the side of my sink for the garbage disposal, and I use the other one for, you know, the other side of the sink. But these things right here are pretty good. The only thing about them, they stain really quick, so that's why I usually buy a bunch of them when I see them. And I also got some of those cuff gloves, guys, that has the different... Um, you know, it has the, like the fabric. It's not really fabric, but the fabric on the outside of the gloves. I forgot to bring them over here. But I got a couple pair of those, too. They had them at DT. And so I picked up a couple, um, the yellow ones, blue, and pink, I think. So I got a couple of those. Okay, so now let me show you guys what I did for my DIY. And hopefully, um, I'm already at six minutes. These minutes go by so quick. Hopefully, I'll get a chance to show you some more stuff before the 20-minute mark run out. If it happens to run out, I'll do a part two to this video, okay? But anyway, let me show you guys what I made. I got this off the line. I mean, everybody on um, YouTube making these, okay? So not one person I can credit with because I've seen a bunch of people making these and then on Pinterest and then other places I saw them. So I saw it and liked it. And I was like, oh, let me try to make something like that. Mine's is not exactly like theirs because um, I think they may have used different gems or whatever the case is. But anyway, this is what I came up with. And um, I just took some of those glass gems like the ones I just showed you, okay? I used my little glue gun that I got from uh, Family, what is it, Dollar General. And um, these are the Dollar Tree napkin ring holders, the silver ones that you see over there with the wedding things. And all I did was took my glue gun, you know, and I um, put some glue gun on here, not all at once, but, you know, parts of it at a time. And then I just basically stuck these glass gems on here the way I wanted it to be and then I just let it dry and, and they're they're holding up pretty good though. Um, my other ones some of them came off so I need to do those over again because this is my first time doing it so and working with a glue gun so a few of them came off so you know I had to put them back on there again but this is one you know I did four of those for my um, table then I did this one and they didn't necessarily have to be exactly the same so that's why I did them like that Cause I don't, you know, I just wanted to be a little different. And so I did this with more red. And I think it came out pretty good, if you can see it. And I'm only using one hand, guys, because as you know, as always, my other hand is not really done. And actually, I need to do this hand over again, too. You know, but it still looks better than my other one. So, but anyway, yeah, that's that one. Beautiful. Oh, man, I just knocked it on the floor. So that's those two together. If you can see them on the table. And then I just wanted to get a little bit different. So, you know, of course, I had to do something extra. <laughs> so I took the little pebbles, you know, and put them on here. Because this was a different look, you know, to make napkin ring holders. And I just did those. Okay. And I made four of these. And they came out pretty good. I mean, the pebbles came off a few times, just like my other ones. And I had to glue them back on there again. You know, but I think overall they came out good. And when I do this look in my dining area, then I'll use these. But I know when I take this stuff up on my table now, the spring stuff, I'll probably use these. And hopefully they stay together, okay? That's one thing that I made, okay, with a DIY. The second thing that I did that I wanted to show you guys is this right here. I am so happy about this, okay? Excuse my hair. You probably saw part of it. I just got it. I had to take it loose because I had it in twist. And, you know, you just have to take your hair loose to let it, um, you know, breathe and just, you know, be free. And so that's what I'm doing. But anyway, I made this terrarium. And, you know, this is Dollar Tree stuff. The bowl is from Dollar Tree. The, um, now, all of these little pebbles in here are not from Dollar Tree. Um, the black ones, if you can see them, are from um, 
the 99 cents store. These are really cute, the black pebbles. And then I got the regular pebbles up here that's from Dollar Tree. And then inside, if you can see it, I have the succulents, okay? And I'm going to actually insert a picture so you guys can see this. And these are um, different succulents that I got from Dollar Tree. I finally found some more, and I just decided to make this. Now, I don't know where I'm going to put this at yet. It's just sitting on my table because I got um, enough stuff out. But once I put the Easter stuff up and get some of this other stuff down, and then I'm going to basically put this, you know, this out. So, but that, this this came out pretty good, and all I spent was probably let's see, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, probably like eight or nine dollars for this whole thing. So I think that was pretty good. Something you know that I made myself and really do like it. I like it better than I like any other um, terrariums I have made, and so you know I'm pretty happy about this. Okay, so those are the things I wanted to show you guys, and um. I said I would try to show you this table real quick, so let me see if I can show it to you real quick. Um, see, one of these stones came off again. I'm about to put them back on here. That's the only thing about this stuff. I don't know. Maybe it's the, the glue that I'm using on the glue gun, but it just comes off so quickly. So I'm going to have to glue that back on. One of, them, one of them came off a few seconds ago, but that's cool because I'm not using them yet anyway, and I'll just glue it back on there. But let me go ahead and show you this. And like I said, if this video happens to go past... 20 minutes, then I'm going to have to do the rest of this haul on another one. But I'm going to try to stop so I can put a few more things on this video to wrap it up. Okay, so let me just hurry up, put this video on pause real quick, and then I'm going to do, show you guys what my table look like. Okay, let me pause it. Now, you know what? I got my camera turned the wrong way, guys. And um, I don't know if it's going to allow me to turn it while I'm recording. So I don't want to mess up the video. But I'm just going to do this little quick thing right here. But when I get through with this video... I'm going to probably make a different video and show you guys the table, okay? Because I don't think this will work. Okay, so let me stop this video here, and I'm going to um, add to this video and show you some more stuff, you know, to get it to close to the 20-minute mark, okay? All right, until then. All right, to finish up my haul, I got eight minutes to finish up my haul, guys. This is the rest of it that I had to add on to the video. Okay, I went to the 99 cent store. Here's the back here, 99 cent store. Okay, I'm still hoarse because of allergies, so you have to excuse my voice, okay? And at the 99 cent store, I got some great um, things, okay? I got this beautiful picture right here of the Eiffel Tower. I can't, I can't believe it. I had just went to another store, um, like maybe 20 minutes before I went to the 99 cent store, just a regular store. And I saw a picture that I wanted of the Eiffel Tower. And I was like, man, I want that. But I didn't really want to, you know, spend the money on it. And then I went to the 99 cent store and saw this. And I couldn't resist it. So I went on and got it. Um, it's a beautiful picture for $1.99. It's a canvas one. This is what the back looks like. Yeah, so, yeah, I got a lot of um, sculptures like this in my apartment. You know, the Eiffel Tower and the picture. So I wanted to, um, you know, add this to it. So that was cute. And then I also got another picture because my daughter dances and she loves um, pictures about, you know, with dancing on it. So I got this for their room. And I thought this was really cute. And again, this is $1.99. The 99 cent store is really, really having some great stuff, guys. So you need to go to it if you have one in your area. <laughs> And then I got a pack of paws. Nothing too interesting about this. It's just that it's honey and lemon, you know. Honey is good for you. Lemon is too. So, hey. <laughs> Something is wrong. <laughs> oh, man. I'm trying to keep this video at 20 minutes, okay? Because my daughter was like, again, she was like, do not stop going over because nobody wants to see all that, you know, 50-minute videos and stuff. And my other daughter was saying the same thing. They laughed at me so hard. I decided to try to cut these videos down to no more than 20. So some of them may be 15. And then I got something else at Dollar Tree, not Dollar Tree at the 99 cent store. I got this beautiful blanket to go over my chair. And this was $3.99. It's a micro plush blanket. And I just basically got this to, like I said, to go over one of my chairs. When I take these um, little things down right here, I'm going to, you know, put this on the other chair. You know, to go with my colors in this area right here, this little dining area. So that was a good um, steal right there. 
Then I went back to DT. I stay in DT all the time because they have such, you know, a lot of good stuff. That's DT. So I got a couple of these containers right here. I got like five or so of these containers right here because I actually put these in my refrigerator on the side on the doors to store ketchup and things like that in it. And I just thought the red would bring out the refrigerator more and make it look better. Because, you know, sometimes these apartment refrigerators are not all that, that up in decor. But um, mine, I still have the, the white one in my um, apartment. Uh, you know, some other people have the silver refrigerators and appliances. I don't really want that because I know I'm going to go crazy with them touching it and handprints. So I actually like my white appliances. And so I got this to go inside of my refrigerator just to make it look a little bit, you know, better and to go in with my um, theme in my kitchen area. I love red. That's my favorite color. One of my most favorite colors, I should say. And then I also got some of these little um, paper lanterns. And I actually got two of these. And I hung um, one up. I hung these two up in my... Well, I'm going to hang this one up in my laundry room. And I got another one in my laundry room. And then I have a different type one that I'm hanging in my kids' bathroom. Okay, Because I just like stuff hang not all throughout my place, but like in my laundry room, just to make it a little bit more, look a little bit more um, homely and somewhere I wouldn't mind being at. So I like to decorate, you know, everything to make it feel comfortable. And then I forgot to show you guys, I got this from, no I didn't, I got this from Dollar Tree. I thought I was thinking I got this from 99 Sister, but I got these from Dollar Tree. I used to eat these a long time ago, back in the day, and I saw them and I was like, oh, let me get this. Even though the, the salt is like 200 milligrams, I'm just going to eat a fruit, and then I'll say when we eat the rest. You know, just like that throughout the whole week or whatever. But anyway, um, hopefully they're fresh. They say they're fresh on the, on the date, but somebody told me that sometimes these stores change dates on these things and make it look like it's fresh. I don't know. That's somebody in another country told me that. But I don't know if it's true about, you know, America. But anyway, um, let's see. What else I got from Dollar Tree? I got so many things in one bag, it's ridiculous. Combined, I got a pack of Tylenol. You know, there's nothing um, fantastic about this. It's the, um, I mean, it works. That's all I can say, okay? And there's three packs in here, six cabinets. Two forces, yeah, two in each one. I got another one of these organizers from Dollar Tree because these are good to have. And I got so many um, little makeup brushes, eye brushes, because I don't really wear all that makeup, but I wear... Um, you know, the stuff that goes on your eyes and stuff. So I got different brushes for that and stuff. And I want to put them in here. And then whatever else I decide to put in here. So fingernail polish. And then here's the other one that I told you guys, that I just told you about, guys about the other paper lantern. And these are cute. I can't wait to put these up. I'll probably put the, the round one in their bathroom and one in the uh, bedroom. I don't know. So that's what those are made out of. So that should be cute, I guess. I guess it should be. We never know. You know what I'm saying? It may be cute. Then again, it may not. I have to see when I put it up. You know, because everything don't go together. And if it don't go together, then I'll put it up. And when I change the theme in the bathrooms, then I'll put it up. Because a lot of times I buy stuff, like I told you guys before in other videos, I'll uh, buy stuff, that, but that doesn't necessarily mean I'm putting it up. You know what I'm saying? That day or whatever. I may, I may use it later on. Okay. So at Dollar Tree, you know, I had to buy some more of these Scotty tissues. Okay, and there are 160 in here. I, I love it when I find the um, 160 sheets versus the 120. To me, these are the best Kleenex you can buy, okay, at Dollar Tree and a lot of other stores. They're very soft, plus it's 33% bonus, and I like the, the box and everything. So I love this. I'm glad Dollar Tree keeps on um, selling these because it's a um, very good Kleenex to use. And excuse me from saying um to when I took, uh, let's see, I'm doing it again. When I took my class in college about public speaking, they said, you know, supposed to say, um, and I just still do it anyway. Okay, I bought an eye mask. I had a pink one, but I saw these at another Dollar Tree. So I took the pink ones back, and I got this color. They had lime, too. So, yeah. I wanted something different, so I got this eye mask. They do work pretty good. I used them before, so that's why I bought this one, just to put on my eyes. Sometimes. Then I got a makeup uh, brush. This is for contour brush, but I don't even wear uh, no type of blush or use it for contour, and I guess, I don't know, because I don't even put makeup on. But if I ever choose to, I'll have this brush. 
you know, just sometimes I'll put stuff on just for a different look or if I'm going out or something. I'll have this brush just for that. But anyway, I got these M&Ms. Okay, I usually don't like to buy the candy, but I think this is okay. And it's the 3.74 ounce. I think these, like, there are six pack bags in here, okay? See, that's why I hate when I be rushing through videos because I have to do a time limit because I'll be seeing all kinds of stuff. I got some of these six pack power clips. Let me see how many minutes I am at, okay? Yeah, I bought some more of these. I, I, I hope these work good. I hope they don't break easy or anything easily. So I got these, okay? And these are the lids for those bowls I got. I don't know. I should have left them in the store, but the lady was like, oh, you should take them. So I took them anyway. And I got a pack of um, Alkaline Sunbeam batteries for hydrating. Even though I don't use these for nothing that's hydrating, really, because, you know, I need real good batteries for stuff like alarms or things like that. So, But I use these for other stuff like the remote controls or things like that. Okay? So they can last long. And let me see if I can get one more bag in here before my mark. I think I'm at my mark, guys. This these men go by so quick. It's ridiculous, man. It goes by so quick. So let me go ahead and end this video. When I do my next video haul, I'll show you guys the rest of the stuff that I have. You guys take care. Have a great remaining day, weekend. Uh, I'll see you guys either next week or I think I'm going to do my videos every two weeks, okay? If I decide to do one next week, I mean, obviously you'll see it up. But if not, it'll be the next two weeks from this date. Okay, I hope you your week um, that you just went through, I hope it was pretty good. And I hope your upcoming week or weeks is beautiful as well. Thank you for watching. I can't even do the shades too because of my voice. But anyway, thank you for watching Shades too. And if you like this video, you can thumbs up. You can also follow me on social media. I don't know if I said this at the beginning of my um, video, but you can follow me on social media at Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Google+, YouTube. Okay, I think I hit them all. Also, you can go check out our book, The Baby Mama Chronicles, at createspace.com and amazon.com. Thanks to all my new subbies. Thanks to all my present subbies. And thanks for all your comments and your likes. And again, thumbs up this video and share it if you like. And have a great day, guys. And I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye. And I'm out. Bye, guys. Oh, let's not be alone. Let's be selfish. Let's be selfish.